Longship Red Force still have a player in this. I didn't even notice, but they had a player hidden the whole entire time. And great knockout of Udo Lines from long range. Can they find another one? Black's getting cut down to one HP, gets behind cover from The Rock. Morph still has firm control of the entire battlefield, however, they're getting that revive. They have 360 degree coverage here. It should still be a win for them. And Nongsha Red Force, he'll pop up, take that one knock, will he get the point? Goes for it, gets the point as well, goes back down, gets caught, won't get the second place finish he was hoping for, and this should be the clean chicken dinner for Morph. Morph looking to put up a 14 elimination chicken dinner to end out the day. A little bit of a resurgence, a return to form for Morph, but it has been outshot, I think, over the course of the day. The question is, how many points will they get here? Because they have got a long way to go to try and take that top spot. And with the fact that Nongshan Red Force were in so late, it's going to be pretty tricky to take that from them here. But they can put a dent in that. Nick the Galaxy also surviving late into the match as Morph close it down. Now has two first aids. QX doesn't have any. His trades do go the way of Coops if he's able to just get one or two tags on. But he steps out wide. He's hard beating the challenge. He's daring QX to step for it. And he's getting oh. the winning shots in through as well. QX is winning out this trade for the time being. But can oh. he be an answer? Coops eats one more. Swaps out to the bison. Oh! So low. QX hiding behind the tree. Coops, can he find cover? Can he make it to this next tree? If he can get this first aid off, he has a massive advantage. But oh! him down just in the nick of time and it will oh. go their way what a way to close it down a deserving celebration coming through as duck said fully grouped up there inco looking to move so uh, next rear actually they are trying to get across the bridge right next to morph and they lose one they lose two on this bridge and this is not a good start for nick the galaxy uh, sorry for <laughs> next rear the third falls as well in their chances to get towards that bubble just to close down that a little bit more. But I'll tell you what, that is three points for more. Third place team looking to extend that lead over, over Nick McGalaxy. That's two though, how? Wayne's gonna push past the down player oh. immediately responded to. Lord didn't manage to pop a res here, but he gets the knock and the flush. Now Sporter with a nade, looking to cook through the window. I think they heard the pin pull. He steps out, he baits the nade to bounce off the window and gets back to cover. A second now invested as Lord swings through, spots the window, but oh. gets back into cover a sliver of HP. And it is Nick the Galaxy holding on by a thread of the thread of the The Nade? Outfit. That should be good. Window. We'll look for it, and there it is. It's going to land straight on to Ralph. Leon, because this ridge that they've stepped up towards should be the winning position here. Udo Alliance have had to flex out in the meantime to take care of Inko, who are still alive with two. Vitaly and Squash in a defilade of their own, but Squash gets lit up, and Bubuhu steps over that ridge line. Excellent. Certainly is. I mean, Udo Alliance, it is out of the realms of possibility that Udo Alliance could jump up towards that third place, but with Morph doing what they're doing here, with the lead that already existed towards those top two. I don't see it being possible after this match. Udo Alliance will extract a little bit of, uh, of blood there from Yoru. Will go down, but they'll have to trade it off for a full flush over onto Olio. And now it's just Flax spraying up towards Cleon. They know exactly where he is. And Boo yeah. will look for the close down here. A close run, steps up, gets the spray. The shotgun in close range is dangerous to deal with, but the jump through, the strafe is good to keep him safe for now. Keeping him penned in, making sure that he can't leave here. Instead, just steps out, and that's going to be a nice, clean sweep. Morph, able. Pickle, but here comes Nongshin Red Force. They are going to roll straight on through, but they get a cut down in the open. This was always going to be a tough push, but they're going to try and make it work nonetheless. Coops is there, ready and waiting. The high ground from Tizzy, the last to fall. The back lines are getting demolished. They've done a lot in this lobby, but they will do no more. Nongshin are eliminated, and in the meantime, FaZe are handling intense game. The push up close to the shack now, and now Nick Galaxy can strike. They're up to 10 eliminations themselves. Wow. Zute, they have somehow miraculously rewarded their way through on this wild rotate from the shack, and they're into the top three. But will FaZe be able to take them down? Redulist, they will take them down. They're all backed up into the corner. Nygma Galaxy can't pull this one out. Yeah, FaZe pushing in. Three up for FaZe. Nygma Galaxy with the only two. It can turn right. Not quite in a position to get a response, but there goes the back line for intense game. Magnolin goes down first. Diego is low and the heal Diego. Not gonna have the best of times there. It's just yellow. 
Oh, what a swivel from Rocky to turn it all the way around. One more bullet would have done it, but it's not going to matter. And now, intense game, under a lot of pressure from this nade. Rocky with a long shot. Adrian somehow dodges that knock there, but the second follow-up is good for one. Cielo into the vehicle, going to just try and send for the hills, get away from this one, because Morph looking just too strong here. Boobahoo will go for the flush. Adrian eats a couple of shots. Cielo also taking a little bit of damage, but gets away just around the land. And they want more as they push in, but Zipian's cut Ooh. through. It's Lord to stay alive for Nigma Galaxy. The challenge of one knows there's a reposition, doesn't have any nades, has a Molotov to jump. Binny, he's showing exactly where he is. <laughs> Both of them know exactly what the other one is doing, exactly what the other one is thinking. Lord is biding his time. No nade in front, Binny. Scare shots. Nothing more than that. Doesn't have a nade of his own either. He looks to loot his teammate. He blasts the door off its hinges, but he's backed off the angle. He's going for it. Binny's oh. pulled. Lord able to hold it down for Nigma Galaxy to go even deeper into this match. Still alive as well. And they're looking for two players to move on through. Wow, Nongsham third party, the more third partying the other team, and Nongsham find an opening. And Zone, this is stage nine, it's going down to the middle. It's a three-way fight. It could go either way with the team's positioning. Hill loses one. Morph down to the three players. 3v2v2. Morph looking to confirm that point. He's still got more players to contend with. Slow and Cleon. Cleon on a nice angle. Takes some shots. No knocks. He's in the open. Ooh. Cleon will go down. Where was the challenge from those two down? Spotted around the side of the road. They might want the flush, but the ridge line is under control. This is a brilliant spot for Nongshim. Vehicle coming into play. Nice hard cover set up there. Will the blue zone push out more first? I believe so. Nongshim playing slow and quiet. Might actually win this match and they're forced into open. Shots raining out here. Taking shots left oh. and right. They cut down one. It's all down to Boboho. Boboho not able to even find a single knock there. And Nongshim <laughs> and disengage this. Spec will have clear lines of sight on him if he just drives away here. This surely has to be a fight to the death for both of these teams if they do realize it. Spec will confirm a point. Becker on the push, DBS in hand. Who's going to win out this one? Always waiting. He doesn't have any first aids left though. And in stage four, closing it on stage five, you are going to have to force this fight. Becker looking for first aids as well, I think. He's going to gonna have to enact that heal bandage is only for Spec. Is it a heal off? coming up through. I'm not entirely sure this is worth it for either of these two players, but Spec gives it up. Oh! Down, right on top of Becker. Can he get out of there? Can he get into the buggy and get through? He's looking for first aid. Three of them are found. Does he have time? Will it take? There's no stims. It's close. It's down to the wire, but I think he just about has it. Just about. And he won. Tiger here giving Lord a challenge, and Lord just playing on points, winning three 1v1s in a row, and Nongshim Red Force fighting with Morph. I was saying Morph could win this match if they could take this fight. One of them does go down. Nongshim Red Force down to just two players. They're taking out. Morph wins the fight on the east side, but who's still up? We have three colors. Mormon! Mormon is still alive, John, and he could potentially oh. ruin things for Lord. Oh. Lord on a tear, though. 1v3 scenario? Yes. Can Lord pull off a miracle here? Seven eliminations right now for Enigma Galaxy. Three more needed. A 10 elimination chicken dinner, but it is such a tall order. Although, look at the util for more. They are really bare right now. They are going to have to push up and maybe take this challenge fairly clean. As Cleon cooks that name. The one and only in the back pocket. He steps up, oh, takes good. damage. Close range as well, but the grows are sure. But can you win out the challenge? One first aid still in Lord's back pocket. The side angle for Cleon. He's taking the challenge. Might have overexposed, but there's the push, and he's on the swivel. Lord is still on for more, but he's so low on HP. He steps out for the challenge, and it is just too much. It was close, and Lord fought for all he was worth. With but they regrouped on towards and Hyper with Shikan looking to put in the performance to the roster strong lead from the front and a lovely challenge over the top of the ridge line. She find keeps oh, it together, said? and he's looking for the reses as well. Cielo not close at off to Res Diego, most likely bleeding out here. And, 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 oh. and Hyper, are they going to get all four of themselves back? back up to wait, they have other by Dixie. Hello? Oh, that looks top. good. Is it on target? Is it going to find the shots? It <gasps> just bubbles short, but it gets a lot. Oh! It took down all the players that were not Res, and the one that was Res gets re knocks Yellow with the nades. 
Boho Ho, sorry, Bo Bo Ho, uh, is to get yep. that res pick up as well. Uh, I don't think the teammates are going to go for it. The blue zone is starting to chunk right there. If anything, anything they're going to confirm the point. They get the point. Tiger is still up. That nade not doing enough damage. He has meds, and there is the finish. More full finish that fight. Up to six elimination points. Lost two. That's it's not terrible. The circle has shifted all. Now, Onsen under threat. Shin crests that ridge line with the bison in hand. Able to rattle off the right shots there. Ventoris trying to hold face with the DBS. Oh. But he eats too much damage for his liking. Goes for the flush instead of the challenge. And now it's all up to the back line coming on through from phase. Mela needs to stand up for the roster in a one versus two, I believe, on this position. Versus Sunan versus 33 set as well. The name forwards and Mela brought very, very low. Looking to move in with that auto shotgun. 33C with the UMP close range. Wants to get the challenge spot to helmet. Goes for the spray and the heal is through for Mela. Oh. He's able to cut one down. Sudan launching the name to the back line. And the spray is good. He takes phase out. STE will stay alive on the top of Everest, but only a three. Ah, sadly. Here comes next Ruya with four. Oh. And over the top, more with two is going to cause a lot of damage onto that team. And you said. What is Yudu Alliance going to be able to do? They're getting knocked right now from the side of STE. Trying to hold themselves together from the top rope. It's Rocky. Looking for the oh, no. Yoru has his back as well. All players too. They beat this two for quite a while, but they're up to nine eliminations.